Hey guys, Tegan here from BlueSense Digital. And in this video, I just wanna quickly go through what negative keywords are in Google Ads and how they work. So diving straight into it, I just wanna first go through where to access the negative keywords section. Let's say we wanted to look at the negative keywords section for this particular shopping campaign. Just a reference, negative keywording doesn't exist for performance max campaigns. So just please note that the negative keywords section simply won't exist for that campaign. So just going through an example for this standard shopping campaign here, click on that campaign, then come down here to keywords and click on keywords and that should automatically select negative keywords. Now from here, you can add negative keywords using this little plus button here and you can save those negative keywords to a new list if necessary, making it easier to just simply add that list of you know, 100, 100, 200 negative keywords to different campaigns easily without having to add each negative keyword individually. Now, going into what is a negative keyword, a negative keyword is a keyword that the campaign will not rank for. So when you add keywords to, let's say for example, search campaigns, those will determine what you rank for. Negative keywords are essentially the opposite to that and will determine the keywords that you don't rank for. So just to quickly go through an example of how to add a negative keyword and the, the details around that. So let's say we wanted to add the negative keyword fresh into this campaign for whatever reason. Go up to the plus icon over here and then we can type in the keyword fresh into this section. Now to note that there are different match types for these keywords. If we leave it without anything on this keyword, so just fresh itself, this is called broad match and any term that broadly matches this negative keyword, the campaign won't serve for. Then one step up from this is called phrase match, which is where you have quotation marks around your keyword. This phrase match essentially means if this phrase appears in your search term or if someone searches for, let's say a long um, search that contains this phrase, your ad won't appear for this particular search. Then one step up from this is called exact match. And this is when you have square brackets around your keyword. So if someone searches for this term directly into the Google search section, the campaign will not rank for the specific keyword. So if they go, let's say for example, fresh fruit, we will serve for that particular keyword because it doesn't directly match this particular uh, keyword. But if someone just searched for fresh in the Google Ads search bar, we won't appear for that because it directly matches what that user is searching for. Generally speaking, when adding negative keywords, you don't use broad match and only go for um, phrase and exact match. So that was it. Another quite simple video, but hopefully that was help. Hope you learned something there. If you have any further questions there, leave them in the comments. And we'll get back to you as soon as possible. If you enjoyed this, like, subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one.